Five money moves the rich don't want you to know. What if I told you that the rich have been keeping secrets from you? That they're money moves that they don't want you to know about, but they could change your financial future forever? In this video, we're going to reveal the top five money moves that the wealthy use to build and maintain their fortunes and show you how you can apply them to your own life. But beware, these strategies are not your typical save more and spend less advice. We're talking about unique, counterintuitive tactics that could transform your finances. You might be thinking, why would the rich keep these secrets from us? Well, the truth is, the wealthy have a vested interest in maintaining their status and keeping the competition at bay. But today, we're going to level the playing field and give you access to the same strategies that they use to stay ahead. Are you ready to discover the secrets to financial success that the rich don't want you to know about? Keep watching to find out the surprising money moves that could change your life. So without further ado, let's dive into the first money move. Money move number one, investing in yourself. When it comes to building wealth, the biggest asset you have is yourself. Investing in yourself means developing your skills, knowledge, and education to increase your earning potential and grow your wealth. The rich understand this concept and they invest in themselves constantly. They take courses, attend workshops, and read books to stay up to date with the latest trends and technologies in their field. And by doing so, they can demand higher salaries, command higher fees, or even start their own business. Investing in yourself doesn't have to be expensive. There are plenty of free or low-cost resources available online, such as YouTube tutorials, podcasts, and online courses. You can also look for opportunities to learn on the job or attend industry events and conferences. The key is to make a commitment to lifelong learning and continuously improving yourself. So, what are some ways that you can invest in yourself? Here are a few ideas to get you started. Take an online course in a new skill or subject. Attend industry conferences or events. Join a professional association or network. Read books on personal development or your industry. Find a mentor or coach to help you grow. By investing in yourself, you'll not only increase your earning potential, but also your overall happiness and satisfaction in life. Money move number two, living below your means. Contrary to popular belief, the key to building wealth is not how much you make, but how much you save. Living below your means means spending less than you earn and saving the rest. The rich know this, and they practice frugality, even when they have a high net worth. Living below your means doesn't mean depriving yourself of everything, though. It means being mindful of your spending and making smart choices. You can start by creating a budget and tracking your expenses to see where your money's going. From there, you can identify areas where you can cut back or find more cost-effective alternatives. So, how can you start living below your means? Here's some tips to help you get started. Create a budget and track your expenses. Look for ways to save on everyday expenses, such as groceries or utilities. Cut back on unnecessary expenses, such as eating out or subscription services. Avoid debt or paid off as soon as possible. Set financial goals and prioritize your spending accordingly. By living below your means, you'll be able to save more money and invest in your future. Money move number three, building multiple streams of income. Relying on one source of income is risky, especially if you lose that job or that source of income dries up. The rich understand this and they have multiple streams of income to diversify their earnings and reduce their risk. Building multiple streams of income can take many forms. You can start a side business, invest in rental properties, or earn passive income through investments or royalties. The key is to find opportunities that align with your skills and interests and they can generate income over time. But how do you start building multiple streams of income? Here's some ideas to get you started. Start a side business or a freelance gig. Invest in rental properties or real estate. Earn passive income through investments or royalties. Sell products or services online. Rent out a room on Airbnb or other platforms. By building multiple streams of income, you'll be able to create a safety net and grow your wealth over time. Money move number four, prioritizing long-term goals over short-term gratification. One of the biggest challenges of building wealth is resisting the temptation of short-term gratification. The rich understand this and they prioritize long-term goals over immediate pleasures. They save for retirement, invest in stocks and real estate, and plan for their financial future. Prioritizing long-term goals requires discipline and patience. It means saying no to instant gratification and making sacrifices in the short term to achieve long-term success. It also means having a plan and sticking to it, even when it's hard. So, how can you prioritize long-term goals? Here are some tips to help you stay focused. Set clear financial goals and create a plan to achieve them. Focus on building wealth over time, not getting rich quick. 
Make a budget and stick to it. Automate your savings and investments. Surround yourself with like-minded people who support your goals. By prioritizing long-term goals, you'll be able to build lasting wealth and achieve your financial freedom. Money move number five, taking calculated risks. Finally, the rich understand the value of taking calculated risks. Building wealth requires taking chances and being willing to fail. The key is to take smart risks, not reckless ones. Taking calculated risks can take many forms. It can mean starting a business, investing in a promising stock, or buying real estate. The key is to do your research, assess the potential risks and rewards, and make informed decisions. So, how can you take calculated risks? Here's some tips to help you make smart decisions. Do your research and gather information. Assess the potential risks and rewards. Consider your risk tolerance and financial situation. Consult with experts or mentors. Start small and build up over time. By taking calculated risks, you'll be able to seize opportunities and build your wealth faster than you ever thought possible. And that's a wrap, folks. We hope you found this video informative and eye-opening. Before we go, we want to ask you a question. Which of these five money moves are you most excited to apply to your own life? Let us know down in the comments below. And don't forget, building wealth isn't about luck or talent. It's about adopting the right mindset and taking intentional action. If you want to stay ahead of the game and achieve financial freedom, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. We post new videos every week on personal finance, investing, and entrepreneurship. Are you ready to take control of your financial future and join the ranks of the rich? Keep watching our channel for more tips and strategies on how to achieve financial success. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.